Hello guys, my name is FX, and welcome to a video. Um, it's not a major video. I don't even know if you're going to see this, but if you are going to see it, then it means that for the amount of waffling on that I'm going to do, there was some sort of kind of tangible um, words that I wanted to come across and say. So by now, I guess, if I've done my uploading schedule properly or whatever, you probably would have seen the first video from Terminator. If you haven't, then why? Um, <laughs> but also, I did like a little brief introduction about, you know, kind of, I don't know what I said. I can't remember. But <laughs> it was something like, you know, being not back because I hate that term. Like, I'm back as if like I went on some sort of like massive adventure to Hobbiton and now I'm back. Um, so it's, it's just a video just to kind of say where I want to go in the future with this. Um, and it's been eight months, man. It's been, that's flown by. I didn't, uh, I, I wish there was some sort of like epic reason that I haven't been uploading. Um, you know, but pff, there isn't and there wasn't. So I guess part of it was just I needed a break, but obviously I don't think I needed an eight month break. Um, when I started, when I started YouTube, right, four, five years ago, where, whenever it was, um, I did it as a hobby, and you and you when when you when you do stuff as a hobby, you put if you're passionate about it, you put your heart and soul in it, and you you do it every day, and you get consistent with it, and hopefully you get better at it and whatnot. And then I started to get a little bit of traffic, as most of you know. Um, I did a video that did that did reasonably well on Facebook, brought a lot of traffic to me. Views started to go up. And then I realized that I could start making pocket money. And not, it, it was never, you know, more than pocket money. It was always pocket money. No matter really how hard I worked, whether it was a four day, whether it was a four video day or a one video day, it was pretty much the same because of the view count and whatnot. But it was always like pocket money. Um, but obviously when you're doing that and you want to try and improve, you kind of start falling into this trap of like the, the statistics um of youtube and i'm not the first youtuber to go through this and i'm not going to be the last youtuber to go through this um but it, it gets to a point where you just in maybe necessarily daily routine in the morning when you wake up and you're having a coffee and, and you're looking at the comments and you're responding to the comments or not in my case but i do read every comment um I'm just lazy. Oh, I've got lazy. I will be better. Um, but like the, like you, you kind of, your your mouse somehow wanders over to like the view count and stuff. You click on it and then you just you're stuck then because either it's gonna be really good and it's gonna set you up for the day, or it's gonna be really shit and you're gonna be in a bit of a mood. Um, because views don't necessarily well they do, but not just directly correlate to money, but they they correlate to relevancy or not and i saw a video the other day of, of someone talking about like streaming and stuff and how you know you can you can be on this high he didn't say this but words to this effect that you could be on this high of getting x amount of people subscribed to you per month and then slowly by slowly but surely maybe they start dropping off one by one and it's a real mind f that because you kind of think, are you doing something wrong? Or, you know, are, are people not exactly liking where you're taking your channel anymore? And, and you know, you want to keep everyone happy, but at the same time, you can't keep everyone happy. And you know that. And obviously, with me doing this for four or five years, whatever it is, I'm obviously not the same person that I used to be back then. And my commentary style is not the same as it used to be back then. The fact that I'm using the camera now is completely different. Um... But, you know, it, I'm not... It, it just... What the hell am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that I think I just got in my head a little bit too much. And it was it was a case of, uh-oh, like, this video didn't do very well. Why did it not do very well? And should I stop doing those type of videos? And should I do this video? And it, it, it's just, it, it is just a massive, like, mind F a little bit. Um... And then I think because of that, I stopped enjoying 
doing videos and i think now that i've had this time off and i've missed this and i've i've just done a block of like terminator resistance recording and i enjoyed it um i was just doing it for me and i and, and by that i mean obviously i'm doing it for you as well but i'm doing it for the love of doing it again i'm doing it like i like i was doing it when no one was watching and i don't know how many people are going to watch me now because obviously i've come and gone so many times i can't even keep up um so i'm not going to say that i'm back because i i don't really like that saying because obviously it means that you know i can never go away again but at least for the time being i'm going to try and be consistent with this um so going forward uh i i don't really know schedule wise i'm sorry if this has been bumming the shit out of you but i just want to get it off my chest um going forward i don't know if i should keep to a schedule because then it again it kind of becomes like a job and it's monotonous and i need to get videos out for certain days and whatever which in turn would probably make the videos shit so if you haven't already uh and you want to then click the subscribe button but also click the little bell icon next to it because then you'll obviously get updated and if you turn on your notifications, then you definitely will get updated when, obviously, I upload something. Um, so, my, my, well, my way of thinking, one sec, I can actually say those words. Uh, and let me know, obviously, your kind of thoughts in the comment section below. But my personal way of thinking at the moment is, I'm going to do certain games. Try, touch wood, because we don't know what I'm like. Try and get through them, like, as a complete playthrough. And then there'll be other videos that are like one-offs. Like, for example, so I've got like going down my Steam uh, library right now. I've got Cooking Sim. Co Excuse me! Puberty was kicking in. Cooking Simulator. And I've got stuff like uh, Thief Simulator. Uh, so those will be like one-offs type thing. And then I've got stuff like Terminator, which may or may not be a, a full playthrough yet. I'm not decided on it. But then I've got stuff like um, a, a Plague thingy whatever it was called that started playing but then my computer broke that's a different thing um so there's there's games that i want to kind of try and take to the end and then there's other games that i think would just be suitable for one off video so don't, that's my way of going forward in terms of streaming for those of you that are interested in that side i am gonna stream again uh i've just formatted my laptop so i've got everything sorted again for that and i'm just like slowly but surely getting everything back on there um so the way that i'm thinking of doing it is I'm going to hopefully stream when I can and when I want to, but it'll probably be mainly either, either either like an afternoon thing or an evening thing, but certainly a weekend thing. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to condense those videos into like the best bits and then put them onto YouTube. So even if you miss the twitch.tv forward slash FX Gamer official live stream, um, then you can still watch it on like the main YouTube channel because I know that a lot of people didn't really like the kind of recording on the live stream and then uploading a youtube but i think if i've got that along with other videos that are so solely recorded for youtube i think it might be you know there'll be a lot more boxes ticked with other people um so yeah i think that's pretty much it i think that's i think that's what i wanted to say kind of i've taken up enough of your time um so yeah that's that's just pretty much what i wanted to say in a nutshell i think um, so yeah, thanks for watching if you're still here. Uh, if you are still here, please notification bell click on it thing. Um, and yeah, it's good to be back. So that being said, thank you so much for watching and I shall see you in the next video. Take it easy guys. Bye.